Now to a wild arrest out of San Bernardino County involving three people from Sacramento. Sheriff's deputies arrested those people after finding five kids locked in a makeshift box in the bed of a truck traveling on the highway in Needles. CBS 13's <clears throat> excuse me, Ryan Hill breaks down what happened and how deputies found the children. I don't recall in over 30 years being here that I've ever heard of a situation quite like this. This picture sending shockwaves throughout parts of California tonight. It looks like an average pickup with a trailer and a makeshift box on the bed, turning out to be much more. And the truck and the trailer it looked a little different, but I don't know that anything about it was actually in violation of any vehicle code. Inside that makeshift box, five children, ranging in ages 1 to 13, locked inside 100 degree heat. The San Bernardino County Sheriff's Department crediting people who tipped them off after hearing cries from inside that box at a rest stop on I-40. So it may have traveled along and, and not been stopped by any law enforcement officer had it not been for those callers. Deputies arrested three people, Kenneth Stanridge, Zona Brazier, and Oshawan Hardy, all from Sacramento here at Bailey Avenue and J Street in Needles, California. All three suspects had criminal records right here in Sacramento County, with Hardy having the longest rap sheet. In fact, he also had a warrant out for his arrest in Sacramento. Officials tell CBS 13 drugs and a shotgun were found inside the truck they were in and that the suspects were headed to Oklahoma. A disturbing find in a remote part of California with a capital city connection that could have had a much more tragic outcome. Children didn't have any um, air conditioning and they didn't have any water. Um, so it was a pretty serious situation. Well, CBS 13 is also learning from the sheriff's department that it's believed that Brazier and the, the children are related, but they're unsure of the exact relationship at this time.